News from around the region and from around the state, this is a Florida Focus News Brief. Hello and welcome to Florida Focus. I'm Mick Rose and today is December 2nd. A man died today following a boating accident yesterday. Authorities say Joseph Citro and Stephen Chadwick were near Crystal Beach and Honeymoon Island when their boat began to take on water. They decided to swim to shore and Citro lost consciousness. They were taken to a local hospital for treatment, but Citro did not survive. Middle school students in Riverview were evacuated this morning after reports of a fire. Hillsborough County firefighters found light smoke when they arrived at Junta Middle School, but no active fire. Firefighters say the incident was caused by an issue with an air conditioning unit and belt. Holiday shoppers have left the stores and are on their computers today. From appliances to clothes to electronics, Cyber Monday is offering big online deals. Consumer experts are expecting a record number of purchases. Retailers are trying to get in on Cyber Monday action by promoting a Cyber Week. Safety Harbor is receiving a check for its new 9-11 memorial. The Master Cut Tool Corporation will present more than $21,000 during tonight's City Commission meeting. The memorial will have a piece of steel savage from the wreckage encased in glass. It will also include three benches that pay tribute to the World Trade Center, Pentagon, and Flight 93. We may not have a Rockefeller Center, but Curtis Hickson Park offers Tampa Winter Fun for the holidays. The Tampa Bay Lightning presents Downtown on Ice, an outdoor skating rink open until January 5th. All proceeds will go towards Friends of Tampa's Summer Scholarship for at-risk children. That's all we have for Florida Focus today. Thank you for watching and have a great evening.